Hi there, uh, I'm Paul Dawson from Conchango. With me is uh, Matthew, Matthew Adams. Hi. Uh, we've just been working on a project that you would have seen in the keynote uh, with Scott Guthrie on uh, Tuesday at PDC um, with our client Tesco. So um, firstly, I'll tell you a little bit about Tesco. Uh, Tesco is uh, the third largest grocery store in the world. Uh, they do about a billion pounds worth of business online. That's grocery delivery to your door. Uh, which makes them the biggest in the world of that. Okay, so we, we start with a gadget because that's where every good Microsoft story starts. <laughs> yeah. um, and uh, you know, the gadget really should just be sat there fairly unobtrusively giving us some kind of useful information. Mm -hmm. uh, but it's also a very quick, easy access point into both Tesco.com and also our application. So here it is. And what you're looking at is, uh, is a cork board. Uh, so, or I guess the, the front of your family refrigerator. Yeah. So where you pin all those messages, the family photos. So here are our messages. Uh, we've got stuff coming in from Facebook. Uh, in fact, let's just say hi to uh, to Howard because he can't make it. Um, and I'll just send that to his uh, SMS, I think. If you want to plan your groceries well, the best way, best way to do it is actually think about what you're eating. Um, so the way for us that we, we thought about that was to give people instant access, not only to calendars, so I can see very quickly that we've got our Tesco delivery uh, tomorrow. Um, there's a few kind of family events going on, we, we know what we're doing on the weekend. Um, and the idea really is that we're linking to things like live calendar, um, but also we might be able to drag things in future from uh, yeah, Outlook and Exchange potentially. So uh, when, when Rob's at work, he can just add something to his calendar. We can see quickly what he's doing that as, dis as different from, uh, from Claire. We've got some other things going on. Turkey, the, oh, there it is, right, great. We'll drag that in for, uh, well, sat big Saturday lunch, I think. Okay. Now, what you may or may not have noticed is this little thing down here. That's the basket. And oh. what it did was automatically add all those ingredients to the basket okay. without me having to think about it. So let's just take a quick look at the basket. Um, in fact, just there we go. So, you know, maybe you've got some stuff in your cupboard already, so you may not want to order everything we've dropped in, but uh -huh. the big challenge with shopping online for groceries is you've got about 40 or 50 items to buy. It's not just one CD or one book, so it's pretty tricky mm -hmm. and it takes people a long time. So it was absolutely critical as part of the challenge here that we can help people do this in a way that is very, very fast because it might take you up to 30 minutes to shop online. Mm -hmm. um, so one of the really good reasons to use a client application, so a Windows application in the home, is that this can be super fast. Um, and also we can do other cool things. So we can do things like say, let's uh, let's not get everything delivered. I need actually, I need some milk tonight. So we'll put that on our pickup shopping list. Okay. And actually I want Rob to pick that up. Um, to see that working. That's gone for pickup, there we go, it's reshuffled. And actually, um, well I'll tell you what, let's go find something else first. So Christmas is coming up. So let's just take a look for our, there's a, got a nice Christmas cake. And one of the things that we knew we could take advantage of was uh, in WPF for things like 3D. Mm -hmm. But we also know how you guys hate fakes and demos, so we <laughs> don't do that. Now this one is is slightly uh, slightly over-engineered because we've done some uh, quite nifty things with it. Like we've actually properly modelled this in 3D. But I'll show you in a minute the, that that's not really what this is about. We like <laughs> Rachel's. We brought Rachel's before. There she is. Can you going to be a she? Is that is that, uh, yeah, is that right? Certainly. Yeah. Okay. So we actually do okay. have quite a lot of uh, product imagery. That, so it's like something like a stand, like a DVD or a, actually a standard cake as opposed uh -huh. to our function Christmas cake. It's very easy to create uh, regular objects, uh -huh. so meshes that we can then just wrap that imagery around mm -hmm. because we wouldn't do this unless you could do it, if, unless the business could maintain it ongoing. Right. So this right. is very, very real um, and uh, particularly comes to life in something like DVDs where you have very standard shapes and very mm -hmm. standard photography and it's very easy to wrap that and render that dynamically in 3D. Awesome, thank you. Thank you. All right.